It's locked. Oh. Okay. All right. We're back with the lost tapes. Uh, I played two games so far, which both of which I really liked. Um, and I don't know. It sounds like something I would not enjoy as much. So let's see what else we got. So I found Garrison Broadcasts here, but I think it wasn't the only one. Oh, wait. Did we have that before? Huh. Consume. Oh, that's directed by Aaron Wise. So let's play that. I know Aaron's work. And I usually enjoy it. There you go. Alright, consume. Is that criticism for like, com not commercialism? Is it? Yes, it is. It's very blurry. I think I need new glasses. Or, I mean, I don't wear glasses, but my husband does. So I know that they always fog up if you walk from the cold into a warm room. That must be so annoying. There should be... Why isn't there an invention, you know, of, of like glasses that can't fog up? Get on with it, NASA or Elon Musk. You know, you want to you want to change the future. Do that. <laughs> Although, no, if Elon is on it, they, they will be glasses that just explode and, you know, shards get into your eyes. So better not. Uh huh. Just a single burning trash can. Ah. <laughs> I actually never, I mean, I saw burning trash can. Oh, there's a person. Hi. You will not survive out here. The longer it will get you too. I will not survive out here. It will get me too. You should go to a doctor. Is that a gigantic little coin? Why did I say little? <laughs> Is that the consume part? Yeah, here's a <laughs> food for thought. Is Ma Super Mario actually a capitalist game? Because you're collecting coins to buy yourself more, more lives? Think about it. What the heck? Press number one key to equip or unequip pistol? No, it's one of those games. Oh, that's a head. Oh, oh, hey. No, shit. What do I, how do I, shit, I forgot what to click. Oh. It's a game within a game. Holy mother! Oh, it's a twist! Amazing. Okay. Eyes wide open. That's funny. It's from Eyes Wide Shot, this movie that I didn't like, by the way. Uh, it's Connor, Death Court 3, two monkeys, and one banana. <laughs> I would read that. No, I wouldn't actually. I read a lot of horror. Divide it. Uh, battle until death, fallen leaves. Lost in Rome. That's really cool. Man, you got me there. And I cannot run, which I actually usually like. I was like, no, I don't want a shooting game. So thank you so much, Aaron. <laughs> it's much appreciated. Why do I open my own bathroom in such a menacing manner? Okay, so we got the creepy bathtub. That is a... Who am I? This is such a, a long, long boy bathtub. Am I very tall? Also, it looks, it looks yucky. Is that a pregnancy test? Ew. Don't use that brush. Just don't. 
Can I do something with it? No, I cannot do anything with the toilet. Okay. Oh, it's an old... So maybe I don't even live in this house. I get PT and Resident Evil 7 vibes from this. But I like it. And Fears to Fathom. Wait a minute. This nearly looks like the Fears to Fathom house. Locked. I don't think we have. Oh, pfft. But di different, because the Fears to Fathom series has a different look. It's more PS1 style or PSX style or whatever it's called. Animals. Swim with turtles. Oh, I would. Battle on death. Is that Aaron? I know he has a beard. I follow him on, on Twitter. If you're, in general, interested into um, indie horror game developers and games, you know, follow him on Twitter. It's really... I really enjoy his tweets. Yeah, that's blood, by the way. <laughs> but it d didn't come from upstairs. Okay. That looks nice. That actually looks tasty. Even though everything else looks so weird in this. Very old and dusty. So why does the food look fresh? Lots of beer. Thick crust. Why would I want to inspect the pizza? I think the washing machine is going. This is empty. It's locked. Oh. Okay. Oh. The fucking thing is in the basement. Ooh. Okay. Clicking on one doesn't do anything. I thought for a second it would maybe... Where does the noise come from? Also, this window's open. <gasps> huh. Oh man, there's so much blood everywhere. Okay, now we're back. I saw this face so many times before. This must be like a stock image. I feel like I saw it at least once or twice before. So many times, once or twice, yeah. I tend to... <laughs> I tend to over-exaggerate. I hope I don't have to run away or anything because this is... This really looks a little bit like the Fierce to Fathom house, the Carson house house. Okay, so we can't see what's in the washing machine because I thought we would discover something horrible. This looks fairly normal. Also, we could escape here into the depth, just the black darkness. Say what you want. Theory. <laughs> just theory. On what? Who cares? It's theory. Temple of the Chosen. Steve Queen, day and night. That looks like something I would probably at least read the back text. So when I pick books in a bookstore, I usually look at the cover. So cover art is very important to me. The title and then... Oh, that's just shirts. I thought there was someone there. Um, then the, you know, text on the back. And I hate it when it's just blurbs and not really a description of what the book is about. And then I read the first page just to see how the writing style is if I enjoy that so much blood oh wait I have to go I didn't miss anything okay <gasps> oh. Oh. Shit. A 
Basil? Andrew Toxic. Party Island. Damn. So we got green, blue, red. Oh, girl power. Death core. They all read the same in the in this family. Ew. Can I read this? I woke up to mommy and daddy fighting again. I don't like it. Chris keeps telling me to hide in my room, but I'm too scared. I heard daddy hit mom quite hard. I think it hurt her fall. I think I heard her fall down the stairs. Daddy got angry and came into my room and started to shout. I had to tidy my room because it's always messy. Well, it now is with all the blood. I left the key to my hiding spot, but I won't say where. It is right where it always is. I can hear mommy crying in the bathroom now. Daddy has left to try and get her. I wish Chris was here right when I need him. So we got green, yellow, blue. But... Wasn't there red? Hmm. Yellow, blue. Wasn't. Huh. Green, blue. No? Huh. Left, right, right. Left, right, right. Oh man, I'm a. Let's see if this is before I pretend like I now know so much more than I did before. Okay. Oh wait. Oh. Good lord. Yeah, now even reading is difficult apparently now for me. Okay. Left. Right. Right. Oh my god. Cupboard key. I'm just waiting for the biggest jump scare of my life. <laughs> oh, a little monkey. It's the... Oh, that's uh, the. Oh, that's a big. That's a big click box. Okay. Somewhere over the rainbow. Let's see if that will be copyrighted. Wait. So where would be the cupboard? Is it here? For a bit. Can I actually open this? Oh my god, I can open this! But there's really nothing in here. Just very drab clothing. Just a little dog. Nothing here. I'm looking for something that could be interpreted as a cupboard. I know what a cupboard is, but... Oh! That wasn't open. Oh no, who did that? Oh, do I want... Shit! Bedroom key. Wait, I thought... I already opened the bedroom. Hello? 
Jane? Are you there? I don't know. Jane, pick up. It's Chris. Fuck. Listen, I don't know what's going on, but I'm coming over. The entire town's gone crazy. People losing their minds. Some guy just tried to attack me, but I made it to my car and I'm on my way. Listen, get Charlotte. Hide. I'm coming to get you. And whatever you do, don't answer the door to anyone. There's something else out here. I, I, uh, I'll be... What's that? It's a very unpleasant noise. Ew. Can you make it stop? It's like The Last of Us, in a way. Jane, these past few months have been incredible. Getting to know you and Charlotte. Oh, so, okay. It's been something I never thought I could experience. I know the situation you are in right now is difficult, but maybe that's why you decided you needed out of there. You needed to get out of there. Even so, I can't help but think that I am a means to an end. The fact that you are married does weigh heavy on me. I love you, I do. But I can't in all good faith tell you to leave him for me. What do we do now? I think you should think about what you really want and decide from there. Think about Charlotte, what she needs and wants. I'll always be there. To the moon and back, Chris. Oh, and this is right here? Next to, wouldn't the husband read it? What's the noise? All right. It's locked. Damn. Can I turn that off? Please? Also, did that open? Just... Wait, did that just open? Oh my god. Oh, this is annoying noise. I was in a, in a burr shack yesterday and they had these buzz buzzer things, but they didn't buzz. They just, they beeped so loud. Strange, no handle. Oh shit, is that the, the wife or Charlotte? Also, who am I? And I don't know why they did this instead of having buzzers, because it would also be so annoying to work in a place like this and have that all the time. So yeah, noises like this, oh, super annoying. Man, I don't know what to make of this game so far. It is kind of interesting, but I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Maybe that's supposed to be a car. Locked. Okay. Well, that's good. I actually don't want to go there. Oh! There we go. The following message is being transmitted at the request of the Office of Civil Defense. This is an emergency broadcast. This is not a test. Local law enforcement agencies are warning of violent arrests in the following counties. Dodge, Lakefield, Battle Ridge, Big Prairie in the following areas. Woodville, Pine Creek, Buckfield, Douglasville, Lakeview Shopping Center, and Buckley Air Force Base. This is a dangerous situation. Stay inside of your home and barricade windows and doors. Wait for law enforcement to arrive. And do not leave your home for any reason. Individuals may act violently and cannot be reasoned with. Avoid individuals displaying signs of aggression at all costs. Repeating, a security alert is in effect until 12 o'clock p.m. Thursday Central Daylight Time. This warning may be extended at any point. Please stay tuned to 1265 a.m. for real-time updates. This message will repeat. Oh my god. Can I turn this off? Please? Oh my god. Please. No. Oh my... Okay, thank... thank god. S so I'm trying to figure out who I am. And because... so maybe already something got in there. Um, 
Because I have two theories here, and one would be really interesting that basically this is like a family um, situation gone, gone awry, and then this happens on top of it, which would be really interesting. And the other one is that this already happened, like someone got in, uh, was locked in the basement, wreaked a lot of havoc. Shit. And, uh. Shit, 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 shit. Um. <gasps> oh god, someone's here. Uh, but who am I? I mean, I was casually playing video games. You know, who would do that in such a situation? Unless I'm the murderer and I already murdered a lot of people. Such a weird noise. I don't see the cupboard. Cupboard? Cupboard she's talking about. Okay, who is walking where? Are there multiple endings? I don't know. Is it downstairs? It could be downstairs. Oh! Oh my god! What the heck? Oh, this wasn't there before. I am a murderer. R -r -r -r. Holy shit! What the heck's wrong with me? Why would I do that? I unlocked the door. Well, you did a lot more than that. So, I now took off the mask? Where would I go? If I were a serial killer, where would I go? <laughs> I really... Like, because I'm not, I don't know. <laughs> I never murdered people. Still looking for the cupboard because I do have the key. But I didn't see something that looked like, hey, open me. I'm that secret thing you're looking for. Okay. So. Uh, maybe let's follow the blood. No. Let's go downstairs. A very interesting but also confounding game so far. Am I the thing in the basement? Yeah, maybe it's actually a victim in the basement. No, it's still locked. Oh. Did I press my face? No, it's, it's handprints. Oh, but the glass. Damn. So are the things invisible? Or what's going on there? Wait, so upstairs was a bathroom as well? I'm confused. I have, I have such a bad memory of locations and directions. So this is very confusing for me right now. locked okay so the image yeah something happened there I think the plant wasn't uh, but there's nothing okay um. huh 
Huh. Ooh, look at the fridge. I think that also wasn't there before. So maybe now something's in the fridge? Oh, shit. What the heck? Flashlight. Oh my god. I'm just like, yeah, I just take the flashlight. No reactions. What's... Oh, shit. Oof. Okay. Ugh. But it's actually not that dark. It's fine. I think it's the same layout. It's not the same, directly same. I think it's the same house as in uh, Fears to Fathom Carson House, but with a completely different layout. That's it, what I wanted to say. And a slightly different look. Oh, shit. Chris, I don't really know how to start this ladder, so I will just say how it comes. I'm pregnant. The baby is yours. You are the only person I have been with in a long time. I am done with messing around and want to be with you. Only you. Always you. Charlotte adores To be careful until I'm ready to leave him though. You know how violent he can be. I just pray he doesn't find out before then, although I believe he may have his suspicions. Okay, if he's abusive bull, like asshole, then I get it why she would betray him. I will try to meet you again at our usual place at the usual time. I need to see you and can't wait to plan the rest of our life together. I can hear him stomping around the house. But am I? Whoop. Whoop. Am I the murderer? Because I'm so calm. Like it would be if if you were the daughter Charlotte. You know, with the video, like the video game playing, that's that's the red flag for me. Why would I be so casual? After, like, I'm in this house, everything's bloody, everything's horrible. Also, wait, is that bleach? The food? Okay, well, whatever. What? What? Oh, the fire looks menacing now? Okay. Oh, that's... okay. So I can't go up... I hear the... Oh! Uh... Oh no! <laughs> was that the husband? The violent husband? But why would I play video game? Or was I first the husband? That's it, I think, right? Maybe? After playing the video game, I was the husband who walked through the house. And then after this weird cut, where I saw the bloody footprints, maybe I was Chris, who was in the house looking for her, and I got killed by the husband. Huh. A little unsure about the story. Do you have any interpretations? Because, yeah, I'm a little bit confused by it. But I like the whole vibe of it. Like, it was really walking around, uncovering horrible things, and then have this outside th monster thing, like the Last of Us thing. <laughs> That's a lot of bullshit to deal with in one single night. Yeah. Anyways, um, yeah, please tell me uh, how you like the game and uh, what your interpretation of the story is. So yeah, my, my official interpretation is that the first half we played as the murderous husband who was basically waiting for Chris to come and to kill him. Because why would we otherwise play a video game? There's no... Or we were the woman who played the video game and first, you know, was more like basically like a premonition going through what would happen. Um... But it makes more sense because with the basement, it said, you know, the, the monster is there. But it was probably not the monster. It was probably already the, the dead wife. So I think it's the, yeah, first half of the game we play as the murderous husband. And second half we play as the uh, knight in shining armor who completely is useless. Like, everyone's dead. I think the, the, the kid was locked in the room and the handle was broken off. So at least we didn't have to look at a child corpse um and then because of the the weird outbreak thingy the husband probably turned into a monster man that's a whole lot of sorry 
Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, if you're new to this channel, you come to subscribe. I play a lot of any horror games, and um, that's usually what you get. A lot of rambling, a lot of, oh, what's going on here? <laughs> I don't know what to do next. Also, maybe there's like a hidden secret if you find the whatever opens uh, the, the secret pathway. Um, or maybe I used it without knowing. I don't know. Again, tell me in the comments if you, if you know more about that. Maybe you saw a Let's Play from someone else uh, who did this. Or maybe you're the developer. Who knows? Uh, yeah, but if, you, if you're new to the channel, you know, you're welcome to subscribe. And I promise you. What do I promise? I, I don't want to put myself in the role of a murderous husband. Because honestly, man, if you're married to me and you just have it with me, you know. I mean, I wouldn't be happy if you betray me and want to leave me uh, for someone else. But honestly, I wouldn't go, I wouldn't get violent, you know. I wouldn't kill you. Even if I would turn into a zombie, I would try not to kill you, you know, I would try to, I know, if I had to kill someone, I would maybe try to, like, go somewhere where there's not a lot of people, so I can't even be, you know, tempted to kill someone, but who knows, like, if you are infected with a weird virus, but I would try my best, you know. That's all I can give you. So subscribe! <laughs> Anyways, I hope you had a good time, I hope you have a wonderful day! And uh, maybe see you next time. Bye bye. This is my self recorded outro song so I don't get hit with copyright claims. If you subscribe, you subscribe to a lot of fun tutorials, reviews, and let's plays.